Hey everybody, this is Rick. I'm gonna be sharing with you how you can give fix OBS if your camera's not showing up. And I'm gonna be sharing with you how to do it specifically on a Mac. If you're on Windows, there's probably other tutorials on YouTube I'll link off to, but if you're on a Mac, I'm gonna be sharing with you how to fix the camera no display issue on OS 10. So without further ado, let's make it do what it do. <music> So here I am on Google, I'll paste the link to the GitHub, but you want to look for GitHub and you want to do OBS. And then you want to head over to their OBS here. I'll paste the link so you won't have to Google it, but you want to go into releases here and you want to download this right here released on September 2nd and you want to download the PKG file. And this is the 2.03 Mac OS hotfix. And if you go to the OBS site, OBS download, like this and you head over here you'll see here that if you click on Mac this is 220.3 over here is 20.0.3 their website when I was originally downloading it wasn't uh, sending off that original uh, download what it was doing it was doing the 20.0.2 on OS 10 so when you click on this download you would get the wrong version so I think there's something wrong with their website or whatever but just go over to github download the 22.0.3 and then download this PKG file here. And then once you download this, you wanna go ahead and uninstall OBS and then install OBS again. And once you do this, you're gonna get a, a screen like this, which there's no, there's no camera. So you're gonna get a dialog like this says, OBS would like to access your camera. And you're gonna click okay. And then boom, there's your camera now working. And that's pretty much all there is to setting up OBS to show up your camera if your camera's not showing up. So that's going to do it here for this video. If you have any questions for me, drop them down below. But pretty much all you have to do is reinstall OBS with that install file, open OBS, and you'll get that dialog. And then once you get the dialog, then you'll be able to do um, the, the acceptance of the camera, and then you'll be able to use OBS with the webcam. If you found this video useful, make sure you click on the like button. Click on the subscribe and make sure you click on the little bell so you get notified when I release new videos. And that's going to do it here for me, so I'll talk to you next time.